Hey guys, it's Kristen. So today I want to show you a really cheap and fast way to make this awesome spider web. There's no reason why you have to spend a ton of money on Halloween decorations. This only cost probably about three bucks to make and it took about 15 minutes. And not only that, it was actually really fun to make. So all you need for this project is some black yarn, some clear tape or some push pins. You'll need a fake spider or you can use this printed spider that I used. I've left that um, image in the description description below. To begin, you're going to want to start building the base or the frame of your web. Um, and you don't need perfectly straight lines, but make sure you are wrapping the yarn around the center every time you cross it so that it stays in the middle. You'll also want to try to keep your lines a little off-centered for a more authentic look. Now we're going to create the spiral. So first tie off your yarn and now you're going to start weaving it in and out around um, each piece of yarn. The way you're going to want to go is whatever direction you're going in, you're first going to cross the yarn, wrap it under and then and bring it forward again. So here you can see I'm going under, pull it over and I kind of pull it snug to make sure that it's not super loose or anything. So again, you're going to go um, across, under, back over, and just keep going all the way around. Um, make sure that your web is not perfectly symmetrical. You can see that some of the areas I pulled it down to almost make like a triangle. They're uneven. At some point, you're going to run out of yarn, and that's totally fine. Just tie it off. And then when you start your next piece, just try to make a knot on the exact same spot. And then you're just going to continue going all the way around. Um, you can make this however you want. I decided to kind of make it a little bit tighter on the right side and make it a lot wider on the left side because when you look at spider webs, they aren't even, they're not symmetrical. Um, they are very wonky. So really customize this however you want. No spider web is going to look exactly the same. Now just finish it off by adding a spider, whether it's a printed spider or one that you get from the store. You can also hang one from the ceiling. There's lots of different options, but that's pretty much it. What I particularly like about this is that it doesn't take very long to make and you can make it as big or small as you want. So if you want to do this on the whole entire side of your house, you know, instead of using yarn, maybe use rope or something like that. The options are really endless, so go crazy. If you guys like the video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you want to see more tutorials like this, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for checking out my channel and watching this video. If you want to see what I'm going to post next, don't forget to subscribe below.